And look, I, I see people always trying to make suggestions about, well, there's an industrial site on Cicero and Kinsey. If you have to remember something really important about the city of Chicago and Arlington Heights, they reside in the same county. And right now, part of the problem that the Bears are having is with the Cook County Assessor. Just like the Blues Brothers. Yeah. And Fritz Kagey is not just going to go away. So he he's very earnest in the way that he wants to go about saving money for people who live in the county of Cook. And I'm I am about that. I'm not here to try to keep the Bears. I've never been about that, about them staying in Chicago. But them being in Chicago for clearly what are the next five years. Because if if he's saying you can't say give me a timetable of three years until a shovel goes into the ground and that it might take another year for them to make a decision on where the shovel is going to be. Think, think about the bears being in soldier field, at least through the 2027 season and probably through the 2028 season. That's it. You have to, because there's also a lease in place. Not that I'd say the bears break it to go somewhere else. But yeah. There's and the city's ready for them to break their lease right. when, the, you know, when that is available to them like that, I but think that's those all part are, of the cost benefit. Yeah. And I think that's all of the stuff that Kevin Warren and Brandon Johnson are reaching detente on. I think it's just two really smart dudes. They're like, this is stupid. Like we have to work together for at least the next five years. So why don't we make it beneficial for everybody? For us to work together. And what Kevin Warren wants, seemingly, in my opinion, is what most fans of the Bears who expect to go to whatever this new place is want to. Want to be comfortable. I want it to be fairly easy, and that's a relative term, fairly easy to get in and out of. I'd like for there to be other events there. I'd like to be able to go see a Final Four in Chicago. WrestleMania in Chicago. And I can do that in a place that has a roof on top of it. The riches that are afforded to a stadium that is new, that has a roof. I, I agree with that. All those things make sense. Ideally, the roof is retractable. Ideally. But all of that costs a ton of money. And that's what they're trying to figure out. The problem is the person you had in place before this didn't go about the process in a way that is suitable for cost cutting. Like you, you can't, you can't say that the Arlington Heights is your sole focus and then suddenly decide that you don't like the price you want to pay for the taxes. The last Bearsy thing that happened before Kevin Warren was hired was the Bears cl closing on that property before hiring their new president. Because I feel like... He should have been in from the very, very, very beginning. I feel like he's been very polite. But there's a part of me that's like, Kevin Warren walks in the door and he's like, okay, I need to see everything on the Arlington Heights deal. I imagine him like in his pajamas and in his slippers, like his glasses like this, in bed, <laughs> reading this thing and being Stocking like... Stocking cap. Yeah, all of it. Wave cap. All the stuff. Like him... Him there in bed and being like, ah, oh, fudge. These fools didn't do what they were supposed to do. You're supposed to make Arlington Heights beg you for that opportunity. And you're supposed to make Naperville beg you for it too. And now he's like, now nah, I got to go out here and campaign and do everything else. Try to fix this mess. It seemed like it really was just them trying to talk to the city. Lori Lightfoot responding as that, meatball as possible, being mad about the Bears record. Yeah. Not discussing how they wanted to put a sports book into Soldier Field, which, if you've seen every other place that has one, seems like a good idea. And then additionally saying, okay, well, if it's not here, then it's the other place and that's it. And it just wasn't it. That's not it. Like, I imagine, I, I imagine Kevin Warren, like, getting out like he's got like the great wife is like super supportive and she's just like honey you'll fix it like you and he's just muttering just like i can't believe it can't believe it. i cannot believe that they did this look at this thing the arlington heights we could have gone anywhere we could have taken this team to rockford do you know i can see him like just being there muttering like do you know that there's all this land on the i-88 corridor right by the top golf we could have put it there do you 
you know that Taco Bell is a very popular restaurant in Rockford? Do you know how much Taco Bell we can get in Rockford?